Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So I am back from my European travels. I went to Croatia and to Barcelona. Jamie and I did and we met up with some of our friends. I am back super tanned more than ever and I hope you guys are ready because I have been posting a bunch of pictures of my outfits from my travels and you guys seem to love them. So I figured that I would do a ultimate dress guide slash everything that I brought and wore to Europe. I have to say that I'm super excited and proud of my finds because a lot of these were really affordable items. And I'm also not normally a dress person but I knew it was gonna be super hot and super humid so I figured dresses are probably the easiest way to go so if you're interested in this video stay tuned um, if you don't follow me on Instagram you should follow me right now I'm just Naomi Boyer on Instagram because there you would have seen or already seen a lot of my outfits that I'm gonna talk about I am gonna talk about some of the outfits that didn't quite make it onto my Instagram feed and I'm also going to show you jewelry items and outfits that I didn't even get to wear but that I still brought as always, everything that I mentioned will be linked in the description box below. If you like what you see so far and you're new to my channel, welcome, my name is Naomi Boyer. Please don't forget before you leave to hit that red subscribe button down below because if you like this video, you'll get more videos like this. Also give me a thumbs up, click the thumbs up button and leave me a comment down below if you wanna see more videos like this. And let's just get started. Don't mind the extra noise if you hear it. They're doing construction and it's really, really loud. Um, other than that, I wanted to quickly mention also, I mentioned earlier that I am not really a dress person. When it comes to dresses, it has to look different. I like it to be unique. I like to feel comfortable in it and I want it to be really, really cute and different. I don't really like just plain dresses. I want it to have an oomph to it. So I feel like this is what I got with all the dresses and outfits that I have and that I brought with me that I'm about to show you and I'm really happy with everything that I found. I'm really glad that I was able to find all these dresses that I'm about to show you. So I want to start off with the dress that I'm actually wearing right now. This one is pretty pricey but don't worry the rest of them are really pretty affordable um this one's from revolve i just love it i had to get it it's like a tie front top it's a double tie front top so it ties around the boobs and then another tie below it and then it's just like a tube dress and what i love about it and what i love about this in dresses is i love the frill at the bottom the frill hem or ruffle hem whatever you want to call it i feel like a frill or ruffle hem um, if you're like me you want some shape when you wear a dress to your body the frill or ruffle hem will give you a lot of shape again i'll link everything in the description box below all right moving on i want to try to get through this as quickly as possible i have a lot of items this second dress i absolutely love um, it's similar to the one i just showed you where it has the tie on the top and the tie on the bottom um, what i loved about it was this little fringe that it had along the skirt I was really surprised this one fit me really nicely this is from shopjaws.com fabrics like a linen fabric I love the neutral colors and the stripes the back just looks like that so for these two dresses right now I did and was able to wear a bra without it showing so if you guys want a video um, showing you guys how I'm able to wear a bra with tie front tops or dresses like this let me know it will have to show me in my bra so I wanted to warn you guys of that before I actually make that video um, if you guys are okay with seeing Seeing me in my bra to demonstrate how I am able to wear a bra under things like this um, let me know in the comments down below anyway love this one so much I got this in an extra small also the dress that I previously showed you guys I got in an extra small as well okay next dress I got from ASOS this one is pretty little thing brand I love all the ruffles in this dress and what I love about it the most is that the back is super super low and I love the really 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 thin spaghetti straps um, and also the straps are stretchy like a bungee cord almost again it has the frill hem like I mentioned earlier it's gonna give your body a lot of nice shape and there's a subtle neutral floral print as well really affordable like I mentioned got a lot of comments on this one so one of my favorites all right next dress that I got this one is from a new online retailer that I found called princesspolly.com they're from Australia the great thing about this website is that they do accept your returns you will have to pay I think it's eight dollars to return it um, but they will refund you it's not a store credit a lot of the Australian sites out there only accept returns for store credit but Princess Polly was actually really really good and really fast I returned a couple things back to them and they emailed me right away told me they received my returns and they refunded me back 
ASAP, um, faster than even ASOS, and so I'm really happy about that. Really glad that I found them. Um, their sizing is pretty true to size, at least for me. Their size six is like an extra small. Um, didn't have to take anything into the tailors, which is great. A lot of these are actually, most or almost all of these items, I didn't have to take to the tailor, which was just a lifesaver for me. And this one is just a really nice fitted white dress. It almost has like this like bustier cups on it. Um, what I liked about it is that it really shaped my body really nicely. The skirt kind of flares out just slightly to kind of give that shape, nice cupping shape around your waist, which is what I love. You can still wear a bra because the back covers it just like that. It has a zip back closure. The straps are adjustable. And again, I got this one in a size six, which is their extra small from princesspolly.com. All right, next is another dress from another new website that I ordered from. This one's from White Fox Boutique. I love their dresses a lot. Their sizing is pretty much the same as Princess Polly. This one I got in size six. What I loved about this dress was that the straps have ruffles, so that's kind of different. The edge of the dress around your boobs have ruffles too. It's like a lace up in the front and the top. The back is a little bit stretchy so that, you know, it's just a little bit flexible like that. It has a zip back closure. The straps are adjustable as well. I love the colors and I love the print. You will notice that almost every single dress that I'm about to show you has print on it. I hope you're proud of me. Um, but I think that's the one thing that I realized that when it comes to dresses is that I kind of need is print. All right, next item that I absolutely love so much, I got it off ASOS.com. It is from the ASOS brand. It's actually not a dress, it's a jumpsuit. It's a white jumpsuit. You may have already seen me post this um, if you follow me on Instagram, but it just looks like this. And it is like a denim material, so it's a little bit on a thicker side, but it is pretty open and bare, you know, from your waist up. Um, so still pretty breathable. I love how the neckline is like a square neckline. The back of the dress laces up just like that. And then they still added a zipper right there um, so you can get in it really easily. I believe I got this in a size zero. I am not sure if this was from the petite section or not. But anyway, it fit me perfectly. I didn't have to get it taken in or anything. Um, this one has pockets, which is amazing. And overall, I think you guys really liked it too when I posted it and it's really, really comfortable. Oh, and then I forgot to mention, um, I wanted to do this in the beginning of the video, but this is the outfit that I wore on the plane. It's a sweat set. It's like a light pink or blush pink sweat set from the laundry room. When I posted this picture on Instagram, you guys went crazy. It has like white splatter print all over. And the top I got in a medium, and this one I just put off the shoulders. And then it has a matching bottom also, jogger style, which is great. I love jogger style when it comes to sweatpants. This one I got in a size small, fit me perfectly. I didn't have to get it taken in. It hits me right at my ankles. One of the most comfortable things I own, and it was perfect for this long flight to Europe. All right, last but not least, I posted this outfit in my stories and then you guys went crazy. Um, I got flooded with DMs about where I got this outfit from. Um, basically, I wore these pants from House of CB. These pants are just, the color is just so, so, so pretty and it's not so bright and just like in your face. It's a really subtle lime green color and it's a really nice satin material. I don't know if you guys remember, but I collaborated with House of CB a couple months ago and I showed this outfit. Basically, these pants are on sale right now, which is awesome. And I think a lot of the stuff that I wore and mentioned in that video is on sale right now. So check that video out if you like outfits and things like this. I have other pants in there too that are great and fun. I will link that video in the description box below as well. But yes, I wore this outfit to dinner and for the top, I wore this crop top. Um, from Maritzia, this one's size extra, extra small. What I love about this crop top is the cinching of the waist here or the elastic waistband and the elastic wrist. So it just went really nicely, really perfectly with the pants. The pants I also got in an extra small from House of CB. All right, so those are all the items that made it on my Instagram. Those are all the items that actually made it onto my feed. We were go, go, go the whole time. And so a lot of these outfits I didn't get to take pictures of. So I'm gonna show you guys right now the outfits that I brought with me that did not make it to my Instagram feed, but that are still super, super cute. And I wish that they did make it. Um, but you may have already seen me wear um, this two-piece set. This one's from Vici, but it's like a smocked 
um, navy blue colored set. This is the crop top that goes with the skirt right here. Not sure if they have it in stock, but I will look for it and I'll look for alternatives if they don't. I love this set together. This is another dress that I got off of ASOS. It's by the brand Motel. This one I brought with me for like a night out, but it's super cute, super comfortable. It's more like a cotton material. Um, it has like those bustier cups, just like that white dress that I showed you earlier. It really nice, hugs the body. The back just looks like that. And this one I also got in an extra small, but I just really loved the floral print on it. And I thought this one was different. Then another dress that didn't make it, I got this dress also from White Fox Boutique. This one's like an off the shoulder dress with lace up in the front. And then it also has like a frill at the boob all around um, through the back. It kind of does flare out of the skirt as well. I love the colors. This one I also got in an extra small. And then I have this light blue romper. This one is also from White Fox, I believe. Actually, no, I think this one's from Princess Polly. This one is also the Motel brand. I just love the color of this romper. I also love the subtle like floral print on it. Um, this one I also got in an extra small. I wore this one when we were riding on the ferry back from Croatia going back to Barcelona and I paired it with a white denim jacket. All right now this dress didn't quite make it on my body at all. I brought it, didn't even get to wear it but it is this white dress. You may have seen you know this dress around. It has like a ruffle sleeve it has a wraparound skirt on the bottom with ruffles as well and it ties at the side. I like this dress, I just kind of feel like it's just around a lot and so I just went with the other choices that I had. All right, this next dress is super cute as well. I got this one on shopjaws.com. It's another lace up front dress. What I loved about this is that you can't really see from afar, but up close you can see there's like a daisy print on it and that's to me what made this dress different. If you still want to wear a bra with this dress, they did add this extra flap on the inside so that you could cover the front just like that if you want to wear a bra. I got this one in a size 6 or extra small. The straps were adjustable which is really nice. I like that it comes with this like extra flap or material up top here in the cups. All right, next dress. I did take pictures of me in this dress. However, I didn't post it, not sure why. Um, but this is like a lemon dress. This one I got from Vici in a size small. Um, I like it a lot. The straps are adjustable. Again, the bottom of the dress has that frill hem, which just gives your body the nicest shape. Really nice and summery. If you're going to Italy, this would be the perfect dress. Another item that I got that you guys seem to love when I posted it is this red floral print romper. This one is cool because it looks like a dress. It has like ruffle shorts and then it crisscrosses in the front as well as in the back. I wore this to the beach with a red bikini underneath it. This one I got from princesspolly.com. I got it in a size six. I love that it also has like a tie. I wasn't sure if the tie was supposed to go through the back, but I liked it in the front, so that's what I did. And then last but not least, this dress I actually wore. Again, I didn't take pictures of it, but this one I got from Boohoo. Um, so what I learned with Boohoo, their sizing runs pretty big, so I can only order from the Boohoo Petite section, which is what this dress is from. This one's from Boohoo Petite and I got it in a size, it says UK4 US1. So if you're petite like me and you want to order from Boohoo, their petite section might be better. But I absolutely love, love, love this dress. I wore this at night to dinner in Barcelona, but it didn't quite make it because I had a whole vision of how I wanted to wear this. But basically I wanted to wear this dress with a straw hat. I really love this dress. I'm surprised it actually fit me perfectly. It has ruffles all around. The bottom of the dress has ruffles also. It just is such a nicely shaped dress. All right, so some of the accessories that I got for the trip that either made it or didn't make it. The first one is a pair of earrings. This one I got on ASOS, but I love these ones so much. This is how they look if I wear them, but basically I wore this with one of my Shop Jaws dresses with my hair tied back in a low bun, 
and it looks really really great I've been really liking these like coin looking earrings a lot lately and then this one didn't quite make it this one's also from ASOS I thought it'd be nice to wear with my hair back in a low bun again as well but I didn't get to wear it not sure why but it's really really cute also I wanted to show you guys some new jewelry that I got from Amanda Deer um, if you're not familiar with Amanda Deer she makes really nice delicate jewelry so I have been wearing this really thin ring that she sent me along with my um, engagement ring this one is gold it's like a gold pave diamond um, ring but I just really like how it looks together this one's my wedding band so that's how I've just been using it also from her that I brought with me um, is this cuff, bracelet cuff. Now a lot of you guys always ask me where my bracelet's from. This one's Cartier. Um, but this one is a really good dupe for it kind of, except it doesn't go all the way around. But it is really easy to get on and off because you can just slip it right on just like that. It looks pretty similar. Um, this one's cute because it has like the sun and the moon and there's some hearts. I don't know if you can see it on here, but it does have some print on it. Um, so for Amanda Deer, I do have a discount code for 10% off. You can just enter my name, Naomi, at checkout and you'll get 10% off anything on her website. Oh, also, these earrings, these are like a disc hoop earring that I got from Princess Polly as well. All right, you guys, that is pretty much it for this ultimate dress guide slash everything that I wore on my European vacation. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Happy shopping. If you guys are going on any trips, these are some really cool pieces that I think you'll love. Again, don't forget everything that I showed you guys, everything that I talked about is linked down below. Just scroll down, click show more, and everything will be on there. I will also link my House of CB video. I will link my codes for Amanda Deer and Miranda Fry. Again, if you made it this far and you like what you see, please hit that red subscribe button down below so you can get more videos like this. Follow me on Instagram as well. If you haven't already, you'll get to see a lot of posts that you may see before I put on here in YouTube. I'm just Naomi on Instagram. Again, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.